What is up guys, it's a Wanted Turtle. Today we are wrapping up our Force of Will opening. So this is part of our new series where we kind of open up some uh, different trading card games that we don't typically do. So basically not Magic Gap, not Pokemon, not Yu-Gi-Oh! And for the first one, we're doing Force of Will. Uh, so this is the new set, Awakening of the Ancients. And uh, yeah, the cards are really cool. The, the art is ridiculous. The card stock is amazing. It's even higher than like... J Japanese Pokemon um, and uh, yeah if you do enjoy this content let me know by hitting that like button down below and that will kind of give me an idea of how how people are enjoying the series and then how aggressively we'll continue new ones um, as far as like what we do next I think I think I'm really interested in opening up some Dragon Ball Z so maybe that's where we go but there's also Final, Final Fantasy um, there's also Buddy Fight uh, Schwartz and uh, so we'll figure it out but uh, if you have an idea of where we should go next, let me know in a comment below as well. So let's see, we got all, most of these commons we kind of probably have seen. Oh, this one doesn't look familiar. The Diabolos Kin. That's one of the... So there are some... I don't know what a secret is. Um, I'm guessing we would recognize it if we did pull one. But uh, so this thing... Mech, Mecha Leviathan is a rare. Followed by Moon the Crimson Sand, which is just an uncommon. But the Diabolos, although I, I'm pretty sure I pulled a Diabolos, but it's it has a different number than the Seeker Rare. But I believe the card itself is the same, so it's a little confusing. I'm guessing it's just like the ultra, uh, full art variety. But hopefully we get one and uh, we'll find out. Fallen into Madness, 200 IQ, a Barrel, a Warrior, a Skana Training Grounds, Kronos' Envoy. That's an uh, interesting art. And then we have just a regular rare, followed by a full art undead tiger, which is a common. Still don't know much about this game. <laughs> well, I did start to do some research. I got quickly confused and didn't have the. Honestly, didn't have the patience to figure it out. <laughs> Don't think I'll be getting into any uh, competitive play for any of these games. Harvesting season, and then the return of God. So there's like a bunch of rares. I think there's like ten SRs. Shoe ruler of the air, and then question mark for the secrets. Uh, but a quick look at um, TCG player. I'm guessing there's three secrets. And they don't even have, I, at the time, they didn't even have like a picture of it. So again, like if we pull it, uh, I'm assuming it would be, it will look absolutely ridiculous. So we'll, we'll realize that. Uh, but man, maybe we won't. Uh, Soul Resonance, reminds me of Soul Eater. We have a Rikugu Tree Shikigami. I'm not sure what a Shikigami is. Then, all right, so here is, let's see if we can get the focus, an SR. We have Nar Nyarla. Character Return of Chaos. That's a pretty cool looking card. Ooh, look at this. Oh, they're just a crawler zombie. It almost, I thought it was like, kind of like how it's kind of hard to see. Thought it would maybe be like a ghost rare kind of thing in Yu-Gi-Oh. We still never pulled like a ultimate rare or ghost rare or anything like that. We'll get one eventually. We have pulled the full out of that card. All right, let's see. We got the house, a beautiful view, a harvester. Interesting. And then we have Roar of Diabolos. Keep getting confused. Oh. All right. Here, here's the uh, Diabolos himself, and this is actually not our. Wait a minute. So this is the full art one. Oh wow. Wait. What's the number? No, it's still number 84. Uh, as far as I can tell, there's like a number... Like a number 3 as well. So I'm still confused, but man, this this got to be a good hit. Very cool. We did pull the full art of Diabolos, which was... SR, so full art SR. Very happy about that. Apparently there's an even better form. I'm <laughs> not sure. I'm not sure what could be better. Maybe it's like a, like Pokemon. It's like all gold or all rainbow or something. 
All right, let's keep going. Yeah, so this is really cool. The only the only problem is I don't know what the what the jackpot hit is. <laughs> Contract force in the sand. We have a shower of, of light blades. We pulled one of these earlier, and then a uh, spiral of chaos, which is a rare. Nice. I don't know anything about ratios, but I'm um, pretty happy with that full art SR. All right, let's see. We can start going through these a little bit quicker. We've got a mirror, big octopus, fallen angel of madness. Probably works for Diabolos, a big old dolphin, and then oh, the one we just pulled, shower of light swords. I do like that art. Ooh, that's a cool one. Alright, at this point we've seen all the commons. I think we've seen him. And another Fenrir. And then Mini the Leviathan. I'm going too fast. Uh, if you check out the first part, the first part, um, we went much slower. And uh, yeah, we've seen all these. Commander's Gaze. Crimson Sand. Not sure I've seen you. And then... Lore Dark Corpse Sorceress. That is just a rare. Followed by something dance. Looks like an uncommon. Not, I guess I am sensing some themes, but nothing. Not as like crazy as like there's like something Shikigami and stuff like that. Not as much as like Yu Gi Oh! as far as like the different archetypes. Alright, we have a new bunny, Nature's Beauty. It's just a rare, followed by a random horse, a holy horse of faith, holy steed. Nice little uncommon. I think I like the how all the cards can be full art better than kind of like how Pokemon does the reverse. I don't know. I feel like the the reverses are kind of you know not not as sought after as I would expect them to be. Pokey's insight, and then Maiden of the Swamps. For a rare, and then is that uncommon? Ah, oh, the round table. So as far as like I don't know, I feel like swagging your deck with reverses is not that not that crazy. Um, versus like what what is is you know like the the special energies, the gold energies, the arc night god. Emperor of the Brutal Burial Grounds. Alright, we got another SR. Very cool. And then... Beneath the Sand. is probably just a common. And, you know, like the full art trainers and supporters like that versus the reverses. But uh, this one, I feel like this is a, a better way to do that. The full arts. Alright, let's just go right to the end. Let's see. We got the Return of God. We've seen this one before. Or just a regular rare. And I believe we've seen you as well. Return of Chaos. Oh, another SR. Oh, nice. Very nice. Oh, we're getting a lot of um, multiple SR full arts. And these secret rares are so secret that I can't even find a picture of it. Alright, let's see. Volley, Moonlight, Nocturne, Harvesting Season, Spiral of Chaos again. And Beast Warrior for me. Rare, nice. I can't remember, maybe it was Buddy Fight. Uh, but I think one of those, one of these games, like one per box, you get like one pack that has all full arts or something like that. Maybe it's a different game. Okay, we got some pretty cool looking samurai. Ooh, something, the Swordsman of Eternal Flame. Ooh, for an SR, nice. And this looks like a common. Yep. Uh, but yeah, let me know in the comments what you think about this series. Um, do you want to see more? And uh, if there's a particular game you would recommend, let me know. We got a Fire Dragon Summoning for a rare. And then some kind of Ice Queen or something. Con contraption mage 
for oh another SR. Boom! There we go. That's like our third SR for this for this opening. Since we don't know what the secret rare is, that's about as good as we can get. All right, let's see. Ooh, this one looks new. Garm held half of God. Oh, interesting. It's a half God. For another SR, nice. And I feel like you get. I wonder how many. Um. So if we ignore like the full arts and stuff, I wonder if it's pretty easy to get all the cards. Which is, I mean, that's a good thing as far as like people that are play competitive. Um. You know, so it's not that expensive. So we have another rare. Uh, ooh. Is that playing on the treasure tree? Oh my gosh, another SR! And this was like a full art. Alright, that's like our fourth one. Alright, on to our last pack. So, will we find out what a secret rare is? Let's see right here, guys. We're gonna slow roll this. We have a cat. I'm not sure what that is. A butterfly. A girl in a white dress. A witch. A bird. Someone having a really bad day. A uh, magic eight ball. Perfect matrix. And then a big old dolphin. So we didn't hit that secret. You may never know what the secret is. Uh, but either way, this is... Yeah, I really enjoyed this. The art is amazing. Cardstock, guys. I can't can't emphasize enough how nice the cardstock is um but yeah definitely let me know your comments what your thoughts are on the series hit that like button if you did enjoy subscribe subscribe for future content if you're not already thanks so much for watching thanks for all the support i'm moana turtle and i'll catch you guys next time peace